Hi children. How are you? I think all of you are fine. So in our last video, we discussed about our country and its neighbors. Okay. So what is our country? India. No? So about our country, India, like how much area it was occupied from east to west, how many kilometers, north to south, how many kilometers, and about the boundaries. All these things we discussed in our last video. And about our neighboring countries. Pakistan in which direction, Nepal in which direction, uh, Sri Lanka in which direction. So all these things we discussed in our last video. So whatever the topic we discussed in our last video, from that uh, topic I gave you a small homework. Five questions. Name the following. So have you written that homework or not? I hope all of you have done it. So here are the answers. Just check your answers. So here is the answers of our last video. So I gave name the following. Whatever the topic we discussed. So here are the questions and answers. The first question, name two directions. We have four directions. North, South, East, West. Here I wrote East and West. You can write any two. Next second one, name two boundaries of India. So four sides, we have four boundaries. North side Himalayas, Western side Arabian Sea, East side Bay of Bengal, South side Indian Ocean. But here I wrote two one. Any two you can write. Next third question, name two states in India. There are 28 states and 9 union territories. Out of that any two. One I wrote Goa and second one Andhra Pradesh. Any two you can write. Next, name two union territories. There are nine union territories. Out of that I wrote two. Delhi and Lakshadweep. You can write Andaman, Nicobar, Pandicherry, Arla, Jammu, Kashmir, Ladakh. Like so, any two you can write. Fifth question, name two neighboring countries of India. So nearly nine to ten neighboring countries are there. Out of that any two. Here I wrote Sri Lanka and Nepal. Otherwise you can write Pakistan and Afghanistan, China, or any, any two you can write. So, like this. Out of these five questions, who wrote five answers correct? For them, three stars. Who wrote two answers correct? For them, two stars. Who wrote only one question answer correct? For them, only one star. Check your answers and keep the stars with you. Okay? So, we know that India is a vast country with an area of 3.28 million square kilometers. And in the population is also, if you see our country, India, it is the second place in the entire world. More than 125 crores of population is there. So, to manage these 125 crores of people, more than 125 crores of people, it's very difficult for the government, whatever the government is doing. For that purpose, for the administration purpose, or for providing the facilities for the people. So, our country India, it was divided into 28 states and 9 union territories. How many states children? 28 states and 9 union territories. So, here see the 28 states and their capitals. Here I wrote one by one I will tell you. You try to remember all of you. So, one by one I will tell you. The first one, our state. In which state we all are living? Andhra Pradesh. So, our state that is first. Andhra Pradesh. So, what is the capital of Andhra Pradesh? Amaravati. What is it, Amma? Amaravati. Next, second one, Arunachal Pradesh. So, what is the capital of Arunachal Pradesh? Itanagar, Assam, Dispur, Bihar, Patna, Chhattisgarh, Raipur, Goa, Panaji, Gujarat, Gandhinagar, Haryana, Chandigarh, Himachal Pradesh, Shimla, Jharkhand, Ranchi, Karnataka, Bengaluru, Kerala, Tiruvananthapuram, Madhya Pradesh, Bhopal, Maharashtra, Mumbai, Manipur, Imphal, Meghalaya, Shillong, Mizoram, Aizwal, Nagaland, Kohima, Odisha, Bhuvaneswar. So these are some of the states and their capital. Here are some other states. Here you see that Punjab, Chandigarh, Rajasthan, Jaipur, Sikkim, Gangtak, Tamil Nadu, Chennai, Telangana, Hyderabad, our beside state, uh, Andhra Pradesh, Telangana was separated from Andhra, you know, in 2014. So, Telangana, Hyderabad, Tripura, Agartala, Uttarakhand, Dehradun, Uttar Pradesh, Lucknow, West Bengal, Kolkata. So, these are the 28 states and their capitals. Now, here we will see the union territories and their capitals. I told you. We have nine union territories. So just uh, up to before, uh, like one year back or six months back, 
we have only 7 million deliveries but uh, uh, BJP government when they made the 370 article then we got uh, 9 union territories Jammu and Kashmir it was divided into 2 union territories so because of that reason we got the 9 union territories so here are the 9 union territories and their capitals the first one Andaman and Nicobar Islands which is in the Bay of Bengal the capital of Andaman and Nicobar Islands is Port Plate second one Chandigarh the capital of Chandigarh is Chandigarh itself Dadra Nagar Haveli capital Silvassa Daman and Dayu the capital is Daman Delhi Delhi so de for Delhi Delhi only what is the importance of Delhi it is the national capital of our country India Delhi is the national capital the capital of a state is the most important part important town or city in the state as it is the seat of the government of the state so New Delhi is the capital of our country for the entire India <laughs> Delhi is the New Delhi is the capital the offices of the government of India are based in New Delhi only like Prime Minister offices uh, most of the important offices the president the prime minister and other ministers of the central government and the officials uh, live here only that's why New Delhi is the capital and it is union territory also so what is the capital Delhi is capital Delhi itself next Jammu and Kashmir that is Srinagar here uh, if you see the capital of Jammu Kashmir for the Jammu Kashmir here uh, two differences are there here one difference so it has uh, in summer season Srinagar is the capital in winter season Jammu is the capital okay like that a uh, small difference next one Ladakh which is like Jammu and Kashmir separated uh, before they are a state now both are Ladakh is a unit area. Ladakh the capital of Ladakh is Leh Lakshadweep which is in the Arabian Sea and uh, the capital is Kavaratti the last but not the least the last union territory that is uh, Puducherry the capital of Puducherry is Puducherry itself only so like that uh, these are the nine union territories and their capitals okay so in our country India we can see 28 states and uh, nine union territories how many states children are 28 states and uh, nine union territories okay so the next topic here unity in diversity so if you see in our country India there are different kinds of people are there majorly we can see different religions also like uh, Hindus are there Muslims are there Christians are there Sikhs Parasikhs Jains different religious people are there so if you see the way of dressing style of these people and uh, the way of eating food items is also different and uh, like the way of um, worshipping their god it is also different so in all aspects we can see some differences in our country and not only here if you see geographically physically also there are uh, so many differences are there so for example if you see in our country uh, if you see uh, uh, Jammu Kashmir it is a very cool place always it was like very cool and coming to the Rajasthan here they, we have Thar desert so it is very hot then coming to our areas like Andhra Pradesh in some other areas so it is moderate not very hot not very cool so in one single land all these differences we can see very hot very cool moderate so that's why this is we can say that the unity in diversity even all these differences are there religion wise differences are there like categories wise differences are there geographically differences are there everywhere so there are 22 languages which are recognized by our constitution so actually there are so many languages but our Indian constitution it was recognized 22 like languages also in our Andhra Pradesh we are speaking Andhra and Telangana Telugu like in one one state one one language okay now so language wise differences are, are there like in uh, so many dressing styles difference are there food items North Indian food items are different our South Indian food items are different like in every aspect uh, even so many differences are there we have that uh, unity that is called as unity in diversity in our country we have the unity in diversity so these are the topics uh, we have covered today so from this topic today the homework is very simple so out of these 28 states and the 9 union territories you practice minimum 10 out of these 28 plus 9 out of these you practice minimum 10 states and capitals uh, without C all of you can okay, know so that is the homework for all of you children okay now thank you bye bye